Welcome back to ADHD Whiskey. My name is Matt. And today, today, welcome back to ADHD Whiskey. My name is Matt. Today, we're going to blend two whiskeys together, hoping for the best, but expecting the worst. Today, we are diving into another experiment in the newest series I like to call Will It Blend? Three videos in a row, we're continuing the Burai train. And on this Burai train, we're putting this nutty son of a bitch, old Ezra seven year, in the same glass as this son of a bitch. Jack Daniels single barrel barrel strength rye whiskey. This is delicious. This is pretty good. And we're gonna find out what happens when Jack Daniels rye gets a little nuts. What do we want more of? Do we, want, do we want more of the old Ezra or do we want more of the Jack Daniels? Let me think. I'm leaning towards two thirds Jack Daniels, one third old Ezra. America. Ten milliliters. Ten. Eleven. Ten. 10-ish milliliters of Jack Daniels Barrel Strength Rye. Cork it. America. 5-ish milliliters of Old Ezra Barrel Strength. Bourbon whiskey. One day I'll get, one day I'll get confident and long pour this. But not until I've built up my confidence. Dripping. Drip, drippity drip drop. Nice. Cork it. Pour it. Shake it. Spin it. What do you guys think? Do you think this is going to work or do you think it's going to be bad? Leave a comment below before I taste it. I have mixed feelings about it, but I'm hoping that it turns out good. I'm hoping that it turns out good. So far, I'm one and one. One of them worked out good. One of them sucked. If you haven't watched my first two Will It Blend videos, here, click up there. Click right up there. And you can see them. You can see you can see more of them. When the spinning stops, the nosing starts. And if you're ready, then I'm ready. Let's do it. Huh. Pretty, pretty ethanol-y. A lot of alcohol vapor coming off of here, probably from all the swirling. Could possibly be from all the swirling. A little bit of peppermint hard candy, like you get at Pizza Hut when you're done with your pizza back in the day. Peppermint hard candy. Huh. It's actually pretty pleasant. It's sweet and spicy. I'm not getting any of the nuttiness from the Lux Row, heaven hell, on the nose. I'm just getting a sweet, a sweet, sweet whiskey. Slightly minty, slightly spicy, almost like bell peppers, which is strange. I've never said bell peppers before, but I can picture like red and orange bell peppers here inside of a cake. It's a bell pepper cake, a bell pepper cake. Hmm. Sounds disgusting, smells really good. All right, now there's some frosting. The sweetness is really turning into a baked good. Less fruit, less candy, more baked good now. Yes. Good morning. Friggin' love it. The no the nose is the nose is refreshing and it's the nose is pleasant. I enjoy the nose. Let's see what it tastes like. Down the hatch. Whoa. Okay. Werther's original. Big time Worthers, big time Worthers, butterscotch, spicy, proofy, mouth coating. It's like a butterscotch oatmeal cookie for sure. That's good. I like that. Let me try one more sip to see what's happening. One more sip. Yeah. So weird. An immediate rye spice takes over. It's like rye whiskey mother effer and you're like i get it i get it i understand don't gotta yell and it's like i can't help it i'm barrel strength and you're like okay i get it 
totally get it. Can you calm down now? And then the rye is like, so sorry, so sorry. But there were a lot of spices and cinnamony, friggin' deliciousness that I needed to hit you with right away, just so you got the point. And you're like, I get it. Now that you're calm, what else is happening? And then peanut slides through the door and a little bit of nuttiness sneaks in and it's like, what's up, brother? I'm smoothy, silky, oily, mouth coatingly delicious creme brulee caramel nutty time. And I finish very nicely. It's like rye spice, then delicious baked butterscotchy nuttiness, oatmeal cookie finish. Wow, that was good as heck. I'm gonna have to do that again. I think the finished product is better than this, for sure. Is it better than this? They're different, it's different. When we put these two in the same glass and shook its ass, we answered the age old question of will it blend? And the answer today is yes. It worked. My name is Matt, this is ADHD Whiskey. Like I always say, keep your head in the clouds, but your mind on hitting the subscribe button and the like button and leaving a comment below, letting me know how much you can bench press with your legs. And then I'll tell you I can do one pound more just so I seem superior, even though I couldn't lift a hammer with both hands. So weak. But seriously, hit subscribe right now.